How's it going, guys? Welcome back to the Weeb Lounge. I am Nick, and in this character spotlight, we have Dragon Mama New Year Edition. Yes, New Year's Homade. This character, behind that sweet little innocent grin, you know nothing is sweet or innocent about her. So if you thought the original version of her was super nuky, kind of crazy girl, um, you ain't seen nothing yet. Okay, now, granted, the original version and this version have slightly different tweaks, but by and large, they are kind of the same character. Just this one and that one, slightly different mechanics, just enough to put them to the side. Is this character worth getting? Oh my god, let's just go ahead and get into it and you will find out. Skill number one, Sticky Bite. Yeah, sticky bite increases her own magic attack power her own magic crit chance her own critical damage and also charges her technique point gauge by like a pretty good chunk 225 there for a single target buff this thing is ridiculous uh it's it's really good it's it, it's not bad it's good okay i'm liking it already skill number two cruel bloom cruel bloom yep cruel bloom Full field magic attack and magic defense debuff. Okay, this one is pretty nice. Because you know, how many characters do you have do an AoE full field attack along with a proper useful debuff or something like that on the enemy? You don't get that all that often. This one has it, and it's useful, and it will stack. It's going to be good, trust me. Especially when we get to the other skills here. EX skill increases magic attack power. Five star greatly increases magic attack power. I'd wonder what side games are smoking if they actually made it something else. I seriously would. It's Homade. It's magic attack. We shouldn't even have to read the text on this. It's like, oh, you have an EX skill? <laughs> we know what it is. It's kind of stupid. I'm still waiting for like an extra skill with her or something, but whatever. Union Burst, it is the Dragon's Tear, and she will make the enemy cry. Trust me on this. Full field magic attack and magic defense debuff, just like skill one, but this one scales depending on the number of enemies or targets she hits. So it's going to hit a lot harder and do a much bigger debuff depending on the number of targets. And she lights this thing off pretty quick, especially in combination with her technique point gauge uh, charge and anything else that you got going, action speed or some other buffs someplace else. New Year's Nanika throwing some buffs on her. My God, this is going to be ridiculous, but it's also her crutch. Now, I told you about the differences between regular Homare and this one. Regular Homare doesn't have any kind of mechanic word dependent on number of targets. It's just AOE, make it work. Hers scales depending on number of targets. So the original Homare, every once in a while you saw a little skill thing or strategy where she's like, okay, it's a single target fight, but she's still handy. So we're going to throw her in there, even though the AOE and I think it actually scales down in reverse, don't it? Maybe more damage, less targets or something. I can't remember. Whatever. You know, guys know my memory sucks. It still does. It's been a while. It still sucks. But anyways, that's what sets the two apart. This one scales based on the more enemies, the better. And she's primarily a boss fight character. But I'll get into that once I start throwing her into combat here. And the, the combat's quick. The combat's so quick. This, this is going to be a short video. I'm just going to tell you right now because she can, she blasts through this really quick and I can only BS so much to keep a video going. Like, seriously. <laughs> it's, it's, there's, there's only so much I can do. Oh, she's going to charge up really quick. It's just like, boom, boom. We killed all those things. She walk into the next one. Do her union burst right off the bat. Here you go. Uh-huh. And then she'll just do it again on the next one. Just right off the bat. Here, do it again. Have fun. Fly around with your ukulele or whatever the heck it is. I know it's not a ukulele. Don't get mad at me. <laughs> Don't get mad and like, share, subscribe, hit that notification button. Like I said, this is probably going to be a short video because the character is overly simple. Um, in terms of boss battles, this is her restriction. She is only good in multi-target fights, right? So you either need to be, you know, constantly spawning enemies, uh, doing Luna Tower, trying to hit a whole bunch of AOE crap or whatever and just nuke the crap out of it. Or you need single bosses that have multiple target zones, you know, a multi-target single boss fight, something like that. That also triggers it. So, yeah, this character is really, really good in what, like EX3 and 4 and 5 and probably 6 and 7. Whatever the heck we get to. She's probably going to be absolutely wonderful against those. And 
in the current special dungeon thingy that we got going on right now. She's like one of the characters that can get to the top and nuke it in one go if you do it right. But of course, all my characters, you know, it's the brick lounge. All my characters are like bricked or whatever, so I can never do it in one freaking go. So lucky me. Yay. Oh, man. But also in the arena. The, the, the character is not bad in the arena. It's not made for the arena, but, you know, higher damage, more targets. There you go. There's five targets to start with. She lights off, boom, high damage. Might actually end up winning in one nuke. You don't know. Could be like a Ninon Go Bird type moment. So you slap her in there and maybe it works. Maybe it don't. She's not made for the arena with the arena in mind. But yes, you can make her work. Oh, this is a double S tier character versus bosses. An S to S plus tier and just about everything else. So that makes her a necessary pull you guys need her if you don't have her get her i feel sorry if you don't i don't know is there banner even still going i think it is still going how much more time we got on this you got a few days get her if you don't have her already highly 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 recommended have i bs enough if i i got the video it's about six minutes or so i'm gonna have to live with it we'll see you guys in the next one